I'll have your hand for that. Oh, welcome back, ladies and gentlemen. It sounds like there's bad things happening around us. Altair, it is good to see you. And in one piece, you as well, friend. I am sorry for your troubles. Think nothing of it. A few of your brothers were here earlier, in fact. Oof, if you'd heard the things they said, I'm certain you'd have slain them where they stood. It's quite all right. Yes, you've never been one for the creed, have you? Is that all? I'm sorry. Sometimes I forget myself. What business brings you to the mass? A man named Tamir. Al Muallam takes issue with the work he does. I meant to end it. Now tell me where to find him. Surely you remember how to track an enemy. Of course. Learn where he will be and when. But that sort of work is best left for... I understand. Oh! Go and search the city. Determine what he's planning and where he works. Preparation makes the victor. What can you tell me of him? Tamir makes his living as a black market merchant, so the Souk district should be your destination. I would suggest you seek out the following places. A small souk northeast of here, the madrasa to our east, and in the gardens north of the Spiro. Focus on these places and he should become well known to you. I assume you want me to return to you when this is done. Yes, come back to me. I'll give you Al Mualim's marker and you'll give us Tamir's life. As you wish. Remember, Altair, if you find yourself in trouble and the city turned against you, return to the Bureau. I can shelter you from the storm. Be warned, though. If your enemies are too close, my door will remain closed until you've lost them. Do you understand? Yes. To bring the enemy inside would compromise the Brotherhood. Very well. Off you go. Alright, so we found the Assassin's Bureau. Home of weird camera angles for no good reason. And we need to find Tamir. As I mentioned, like, that, throughout that whole time, I could hear... People verbally accosting each other out here. It sounds like there's a woman in trouble. Doesn't look like I can, uh... Doesn't look like I can aerial assassinate people anymore. I'm very used to Dark Souls, where you flick the right stick in order to change targets. Does not happen in this game. I can't wait until I have the counter attack. Because it gets a little bit. a little bit old just having to hack away at people's guards. It'll be a lot more dynamic when I'm actually countering. Thank you. Thank you. I'll find a way to repay this kindness, I swear it. Huh? Show yourself. Yay, saving people. And that guard is... Who saw what happened here? Unwise to who I am. Vigilantes help you by blocking your pursuers. There's that more is that who I've got here? I'll be right All here, right, where are you? You can count on me, friend. I'll walk away slowly. There we go. I am testing out live streaming of uh, this little episode here. Is this, a, is this a viewpoint that I've already got? I don't think it is. Oh. I just finally realized that when I'm on PC, I have like... I have a separate device that can record everything. So I can still have like super high quality local recordings while doing a live stream, which is cool. I want to I want to test that out. And so that's what I'm doing right now. Sim Spartan in the chat asks what everyone thinks about Dark Souls 2. I think Dark Souls 2 looks absolutely amazing. 
And by that I mean I think it looks pretty much like Dark Souls 1, like almost the same as Dark Souls 1. And from my gameplay, it's it's just got some slight tweaks to the to the gameplay. I have gotten a chance to play the beta of it. Um, incredibly fun game. Massively looking forward to it. We'll probably do two walkthroughs, one on the media cows and one here on Tom Walks Through. Come. Right, we've got an eavesdrop here. Everything's new. Everything's perfectly priced. Where is a nearby bench? There's a bench. Oh, oh no, char carriers. Can I actually lock onto him? He's on the other side of that wall. Different bench. Over here, this bench. This is the bench. You can see it's far more comfortable. I'm telling you, it's rats. No, it's children. I hear them laughing. Rats or children. Either way, it's bad for business. All that noise. Someone needs to get up on those beams and clear them out. I wonder how they're getting up there. Must be through the central courtyard. Then we should ask the guard to have a look. Ah, they're all much too busy polishing the backside of their master. Beams which cross the central courtyard can be accessed. Alright. That's all the investigation we need. We just need to know about that... those beams. Oh, I was... I didn't mean it! I didn't mean it! <laughs> I don't know what the- oh, what? Okay, fine. We'll just, we'll just kill a guy real quick then. Censor. You know, to protect your virgin eyes. Not, not in an offensive way, it's just, you know, like, like, oh no, my virgin ears, that sort of way. I just, I know, I know you guys are just sensitive individuals, that's all. I didn't mean to imply that you could not secure a woman to have sex with. I'm sure the ladies loved your company. Is that guard running away from me right now? Are we, we good now? Okay, they seem to just flood through that wall quite a bit. The the fog wall. Seems unfair if you ask me. Oh, oh god. Climb. Climb faster. Come on. You can do it. Come up here. Need to find a hide spot, that's all. Marked in blue on my map. I see him! I'll get you! Oh jeez. Oh jeez. I was not considering that, in all honesty. You will not get away from me. Still running, still running. I know this city well. I will find you. You will not find me. I don't know this city well. Oh, I guess I could have just hit on that bench and it would have been fine. <laughs> Sucker. You do well to hide. If, if this were Assassin's Creed 4, I would have popped up right behind him and assassinated him just for fun. But I'm not nearly as familiar with the mechanics in this game. Okay, uh, we're by a few points. Fairly close to the Assassin's Bureau, but not so close that I'm hesitant to take a moment out to go check out this few point. But fate intended otherwise. Why is he doing that? What, what was the so story that guy was? Gave the man his food. They're talking about to me. When the battle was finished, the Saracen leader saw to it that the merchant was repaid a thousand times. 
So Tamir gave the man his food. And when the battle was Wait. finished, the Saracen leader saw to it that the merchant was repaid a thousand This guy's times. story is rather repetitive, wouldn't you say? Tamir drove a caravan in those days. There he goes. Damas and Jerusalem. But recent business had been poor. It seemed there were none in Jerusalem who wanted what he had. Fruits and vegetables from nearby farms. It was just before Hatim. The Saracens were low on food and in desperate need of resupply. But there was no relief in sight. Alright, I'm gonna get a... Go to the map in order to get an overview of how we can get to the Assassin's Bureau quickly and efficiently. So we probably just want to go... Off to the right, real quick. Those days between Damas and Jerusalem, uh, no. but recent business had been poor. It seemed there were no, none in Jerusalem who wanted what something. he had. All right, I'm so glad to be away from that dude telling the story of Tamir over and over again. <laughs> to the Assassins Bureau. Entrance is on the roof. Of course it is. Ah, hey, what? Come. <laughs> All right. I feel a little bit like a dope on that one. That looked like a uh, Abstergo orb, whatever they're called. So we drop down here. Altair, welcome! Welcome! I've done what you asked. Now give me the marker. First things first. Tell me what you know. Tamir rules over the Souk El Salah. He makes his fortune selling arms and armor and is supported by many in this endeavor. Blacksmiths, traders, financiers. He's the largest death dealer in the land. And have you devised a way to rid us of this blight? A meeting is being arranged at Souk El Salah to discuss an important sale. They say it's the largest deal Tamir has ever made. He'll be distracted with his work. That's when I'll strike. Your plan seems solid enough. I give you leave to go. Let Al Mualim's will be done. You may rest here until you are ready. We will seek to do Al Wallam's will. But only. Only. Fast because he is closest to the bird. Supply. He's in the souk. He's preparing a large shipment of weapons, and this is the time to strike. We have a nice indicator on our mini map. Is that little four symbol thing near me, vigilantes? Okay, that's what that means. But we want to go to the assassination target. Cross some beams. Probably want to stick to the rooftops as much as possible. Since we know that we will be crossing beams in the central courtyard. Also, for my whole life, I've really been uh, pronouncing Damask wrong. And definitely going with Damascus. Just very, very look at the letters and read them the way that they look. Like what you see? Could I no, <laughs> I heard recently that, particularly in Scottish names, the way that you're supposed to pronounce them is by reading them and then giving up halfway through. All right. Will we remain hidden for up here? A few coins. All I ask is for a few coins. Please, sir, have any money? Hmm. My family is to I'm rather confused. I can no longer free run. I'm so hungry. Just a little money, I beg of you. Please, can't you spare something? I'm poor and sick and hungry. This is very confusing to me. So I, I think that I have to drop down off of this. We can see that we're more zoomed in on ourselves. I beg of you. I beg of you, 
just a few coins, please. No, you don't understand. If I you just know. have a look. 